so in this video tutorial we'll be discussing about loops and uh, first loop which we are gonna discuss is while loop so let's go start so uh, make sure you are in your php tag and your sam server or map server is running currently which is empty and now if i paste some codes over here right uh, if i write this thing one then while and here we give our condition and we want to increment the value of x by one in this condition and i want to print the value of x the value of x is and if simply we are using this uh, double quote string so i can simply pass the value variable over here and i want to increase the value of x by one dollar x plus plus so if i say um dollar x is less than 10 and let's go and check what happens now so if i reload the value of it printed first line that it's the value let me make it quite bigger so that you can see that properly on the screen here i have my closing h4 tags and if i save now and reload the first line of block is says the value of x is one and the second line of block is saying the value of x is two then three then four and so on so as long as this condition is fulfilled this block of code will keep on executing again and again and first time it executed with the value of one so we got the value of one over here and then the second time we incremented that value by one so we use plus uh, plus one plus plus x so this is the way how we can use the while loops so let me quickly comment this out and if i now we'll talk about the two while loops so this one is for while loops and then to while loop and now see what we have here so i will take this x as a variable over here again and the, the curve the comment is like first of all uh, whatever we want to do we want to just print it out over here and And I'll put simply while and whatever the condition you want to check is should be there so less than 10 and now see what happens yeah dance with the ternary or uh, semicolon at all so so now see if I reload this page what happens it printed our values till 9 until this condition was fulfilled but what if the value of x is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, first time it takes But what if the value of the x is equal to 10 or less than 1? Then I'll check this out. So if I reload, this condition is true, but this loop is at least executed once because at that time this uh, uh, the first time we want to execute that anyways and uh, after that we yeah, started checking the checking the condition so this is the way how we are going to deal with the two while loop then next one is the for loops for loop uh, these are very helpful part of the php in parsing the data um, so to start with a for loop we can simply simply write for and here whatever the block of code we are gonna execute should go in between there so dollar x is equal to zero let's say and this is the initialization of the variable first of all so dollar x is zero here now we want to give the condition over here less than or equal to 10 and I want I also want to increment the value by one so and I want to pass the, uh, the same statement now if I reload this thing so first of all the value of X was uh, this block of code let me quickly comment this out and now the block of the code is running the first time is zero and then one two three four five until this condition is satisfied 
firstly we will initialize the variable over here then it will check for this condition of the variable if that condition is still true then the, this block of code will execute and then it will take control this bar and here we are seeing seeing that the value of x should be increased by one so this will keep first time it will go like this then check condition that can enter the cloud code block then get here and get here then check the condition then again get here get back to the code block and so this will keep on moving until this condition is satisfied so